Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Laura Croft Tomb Raider Anniversary. I have never played a Tomb Raider game. Um, well, I shouldn't say I've never played a Tomb Raider game. I played the first one for about 10 minutes and got really pissed off with the controls because it was one of those um, up was always forward, no matter what way your character, like, it was always forward for your character. So if your character was facing to the right, you push forward, she would walk forward instead of going in the direction on the screen. That always frustrated me when games were like that. So I never actually played it. This one's not like that. I don't know if that one had a change in controls, but yeah. Anyway, this one, this one seems more logical control wise to me. I've played the demo for Tomb Raider Anniversary and was kind of impressed by it. So let's uh, hop in here and we're going to play a game. Um, let's... Duh. Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Tomb Raider Anniversary. So I have not really played a Tomb Raider game. I played the first one, like the first, 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 first one, not the remake of the first one, which is actually this one. Um, many, many, many years ago, um, hated it, absolutely hated it, based purely on the controls. It was one of those ones where if your character was facing to the right and you pushed up, she would walk forward, so she would walk to the right. If he was facing to the left and you pushed forward, she would walk to the left. It was very, very awkward, and my brain just could not grasp it. I don't know if the controls in it had were changeable. Don't really care at this point. That's many years ago, many computers ago, this is a remake, and it's not like that. I, it actually has logical controls as far as I'm concerned. I have played the demo for this. So what we're going to do is we're going to hop in here and we're going to choose, I guess, medium difficulty, whatever the hell it gives me. I don't know. And let's see what we're going to do. Calcutta, India. Now, what's a man oh, got to oh, do nice. to get that sort of attention from you? If that's the sort of attention you want, Larson, you're well on your way. Sounds like fun, but I'm only here to make an introduction. Lara Croft, meet Jacqueline Natla of Natla Technologies. Good afternoon, Miss Croft. <laughs> she My looks research so department evil. has recently turned its focus to the study of ancient artifacts. What are nails? And I'm led to believe that with the right incentive, you're just the woman to find them for me. I'm afraid you've been misled. I only play for sport. Which is precisely why I've come to you, Miss Croft. This is a game you've played before, with your father. You both spent years searching for the Skion of Atlantis. All you needed was the location of Qualopec's tomb. You found Vilcabamba. How quickly can you get to Peru? Oh, Laura. Or Lara. Whatever you want to say. Continues to elude I'd say Laura. And my insistence that we press on in spite of these failures has morale low. I suspect Jenkins to be the author of this sedition. He simply refuses to accept the possibility that Atlantis is the foundation upon which all known civilizations were built. Increasingly, I find it is Lara alone who remains untainted by academic dogma. And it's gotta be cold to see this truth. Wearing what she's wearing. Like, seriously. Poor guy. He almost fell and died. Lo siento! No traje bastante cuerda! Not to worry! 
I'll find another way up. <laughs> I, I, I never quite got the, you know, you can understand what each other is saying, but you're not going to say it to them in their language. I, I just don't quite get it. So here we are. We are um, not dressed for the weather. And how do we... Where is it that we want to go? There is some weird, like, motion blur. And I'm not fond of that. I've got to... I believe I'm going to have to look in the config files to see how to turn that off. Because, well, let's be honest. Motion blur is fucking pointless. <laughs> okay, that was funny. All right, so where the hell am I supposed to go? I see things. Oh, come on. Ah, there we go. You know, now that I see it, it was quite obvious. Press E repeatedly in time with Laura's. Oh, okay. Except that's awkward as fuck. <laughs> Pressing E and D at the same time? Oh, what the? Oh, I had to jump backwards. That motion blur. It's so... Wow. It's just really bad. Because it's so, like, inconsistent. Like, there's no motion blur here. But there, there's motion blur. And that's just a camera glitch. <laughs> oh dear. Alright, so... And up we go. Alright. So I know this was meant for... Um, using a controller. And I'm using my mouse and keyboard. Oh. Oh, I have a grappling hook already? Um... Why aren't you... <laughs> uh... Why? Seriously? <laughs> Seriously? Why aren't you throwing it up? Jump and quickly press Q. No, turn that way. Jump. And there we go. Oh. Apparently, I have to hold on to it. Oh, no. Oh. Okay, you actually have to, like, jump off. Okay, that was, I don't know what the fuck I was thinking. Like I said, never really played Lara Croft. Or, I guess, Tomb Raider. Don't really know how it works. Don't really get it. There looks like there might be something up there. Oh, God, that motion blur. Up. Aha. Oops. I guess we should probably talk to this guy. Hi. Oh, I just ah. as E. <laughs> right. Yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Thanks, guy. Well, he was completely useless. God, the motion blur. All in all, it actually controls quite well. Uh, aside from the camera constantly wanting to change position. And trying to, you know, inform me of what I want to do. Like, it, it constantly doing that is frustrating as hell. And something comes out and eats his face. <laughs> Oh, now we get to do nothing. All righty then. Goodbye. So, who shot him? 
I guess it was Laura that shot him. Just couldn't see it. Really? The guy's dead already? And he's like, well, he was carrying all my stuff, but... Eh. Fuck it. We'll just leave him to die. Eh. Didn't really need him anyway. Oh, hello. Ha ha ha. Shoot. This is fairly elaborate. I have to give it that. You know, the advancements that these guys have in their tombs, I can't go up there, is pretty, pretty amazing. I guess this isn't really technically a tomb. I don't really get the Tomb Raider thing, to be honest. I don't think she usually goes into tombs, does she? These are more like ancient temples and stuff. What do we got here? We have a lever. Let's just pull this random lever. This isn't ominous at all. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. There are more of you. Is that it? Is that it? There's no more? How did wolves get in here? I got a medium health pack. Crossing the bridge. Cro oh, shit. Why does this pathway <laughs> kind of... Well, aside from confusing the crap out of me, it worries me. Jump towards the rope. And we grab the rope. No, we want to go this way. This way. This way. Go! Come on, Lara. Yes, I'm fully aware of the swinging mechanic. It is the same as the grappling hook. Oh, nice. Oh, is this a big health pack? Nice. All right, and... Oh, shit! You are a bear! Holy crap. I just had to murder a bear. Press and hold space to jump higher. Higher and higher! Okay. Is there anything I can jump on? Not really. So, this way! Woo! Swing and a miss! Got it. Run! Run, Laura! Run! Haha! <laughs> you totally missed everything and then stepped on a pressure plate because you're a nub! Access Laura's journal in the items menu. How do you get to the inventory screen? Screen. Okay, so tab brings me to the gear menu. I does not do anything. Ah. Uh, <laughs> hmm. B. Yeah, not a freaking clue. Gear. Switch items. Aha! There it is. So, this is the inventory screen. Good to know, good to know. So I can't just click on... Oh, I can. Okay. This door. Thanks. Thanks, Laura. Your, your, your thoughts are amazing. So did that actually... Okay. So it must be like... This, this opens the door... Stop moving the goddamn camera. If I wanted the camera to move, I would totes move it. Spin it around the pole. Huzzah! Got it. There's another big ass door. Oh. We have entered a city that is apparently buried. Yet things still seem to be working fairly well for them. And of course, you know, bears and wolves live here. They're really dumb. 
<laughs> like, like, really, really dumb. <laughs> oh. Well, that's sad. Did they actually build it underneath, under the ground? That just seems weird. Oh, good. Another bear. There you are. Seriously. Really? That thing could charge and change direction at top speed. That just doesn't seem right. That is a thing. To use items. Press E to access inventory to use items. Really? Is, is this going to be... Hmm, interesting. interesting. <laughs> Fuck off, Laura. Your thoughts are useless. Come on. Up. Nope. Oh, hell. There's a thing. Okay. What is this? We're totally gonna drown. Go up, 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 up. Yep, yeah, that was near drownage. And checkpoint. Okay, so we got we got nothing. Can you climb up? Up. Up, Laura. Laura, up. Ah, there we go. <laughs> that was... Oh my god, that was hilarious. Oh, do the... Do the sexy wipe of the hair. Um... What are you, guy? Are you like a... Oh, you're like, arms are tied behind your back. Your legs appear to have been chopped off. And you're clearly dead. Look, we can use the key. And it mechanically lowers the gate. And more wolves. Seriously, how do these wolves survive in here? Ow. Seriously, Wolf? <laughs> oh, horrible at combat. Is there anything down there? Doesn't look like it. it's just like a safe fall. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm great. I'm awesome. So I managed to turn off that uh, motion blur, which is great. Turned off motion blur, ended up turning on anti-aliasing. See how this works. And apparently, upon inspection and learning, I guess, um, the AI issues where the uh, wolves and whatnot were running into walls is apparently caused by not having V-Sync on. Get dead. Oh yeah, the, they died a little bit better than they did before. Up we go. <laughs> and she does that. Does that. She does that. Ha! Uh-oh. Uh... Hop, da da hop. Do the wall hop. The wall bunny hop. The bunny wall hop. The Andy Warhol. Ha ha! Ta da! Okay. Ah! So they just open up on their own. 
This is some pretty impressive technology, I have to say. Ha ha! Got it. I'm getting okay at this. Laura can balance on thin vertical structures. Of course she can. She's Laura Effencroft. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please hit that like button down below. You can also follow me on Twitter, follow me on Twitch, or add me to your Google Plus circles. I also have a Patreon campaign going on. Feel free to support me on there if you so desire. And if you want to see more, click that subscribe button.